Jane is with us. She's awesome, too, and she has Aww. a store available right there in downtown Kingfield. It's the rage. That's, you know, people have, uh, I don't know what we did before you were in Kingfield, <laughs> you know? Well, it's awesome being there because we have over 25 local artists yeah. with their goods. We have Sugarloaf Apparel. We have jewelry by Carabasso Valley Jewelry, yeah. Claudia Dillis Calendars. Um, Joe James's rugs. We have wine glasses. We have like it's so much fun to just watch people kind of walk around and see all the nice little things, and to have a place for all the local artists to sell their goods. Absolutely. And I just wandered around, and you came up with some great suggestions. I got all my shopping done here for Christmas. <laughs> that was great. Yeah, we have a little bit of everything. It's not Custom just a woman's stuff. gift shop. Right. Gift shop. It's yeah. for men too, and. It's, a, it's just great. And it's 30% off all Sugarloaf t-shirts and sweatshirts right now. Like, like these? Like this now? one, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, we have a bunch of uh, different designs. And so if you want to grab a little souvenir on your way out of the mountain, mm -hmm. we're right on the corner of Depot across from Annie's. Mm -hmm. So it's really convenient to stop and come on in and get yourself a bargain. Right. Now, uh, you also have a little section out back, some used items where you, where you uh, raise some money. Oh, yeah. Yep. All the, we got donations of outerwear, yeah. pants and coats, and all that is going to the ski club, the money. Mm -hmm. So we raised, last year we raised $1,000, yeah. and I think we're over that this year, so that's great. Now, you're a ski mom. I am. Yeah. I am yeah, a ski you're mom. You're a ski mom, and uh, one of the hardest workers I know, right here. And you've got a scared that's doing. <laughs> Maggie, it's doing some, it's some great work, although she was suffering from the flu. Bring yeah. us up to date. Well, she just got back from the Youth Olympics in yeah. South Korea. Yeah. And she and her teammate Morgan were the U.S. representatives. They were Team USA, and these girls have worked so hard to get where they are, and they Cooling. have been on. They've been in all the Norams. They went to Junior Worlds last year. Yeah. And uh, Morgan did awesome. She came home with three silvers. That's awesome. Maggie, unfortunately, got the flu the night before training day. But you know what? She did every run, every run. Whoa. And she's ninth. She came in ninth in yeah. the world. Yeah. So. You know, imagine what she can do when she's that. not throwing up and have a fever uh, of 102. <laughs> I just feel so bad for her to have that moment. And then to take that determination and turn it into, I don't know, I'm racing. Oh, yeah, she did. She Where said she almost she blacked gets out. That, uh, that <laughs> I don't know. Huh? I don't, you know what? As Mama Jean, I told Mama Jean, her first teacher, ski yeah. teacher, about the story, and she's like, now she knows what it's like to be a woman. You throw up and you just keep going. <laughs> like, perfect. That's, that's perfect. Right. That's my wife said. Yeah. You, know what, you got a man cold. <laughs> <laughs> but, you, it up. but you know what we need? These girls need sponsors. Right. It's because, expensive too. Yeah, it is. And you know, Seth Westcott years ago was in the same spot, mm -hmm. and he created Team USA for snowboard cross. And now these girls are in the same spot. So mm -hmm. I'm asking all you sugar loafers, if you want to make history and do exactly what Seth did, then call CVA and tell them that you want to sponsor them because they need sponsors. They need attention. Team USA is watching them right now. Yeah. Like, so for the Olympics, 2026. So close. But we just need a lot of support. Yeah. And this mountain is nothing but supportive of skiers right. and snowboarders. Right. But now it's their turn, and they need all of you for their help. Well, everybody is proud of the local talent. Yeah. And everybody is, I think, kind of expects that someone's going to be a, an Olympian. Oh, my gosh. CVA is full of them they right now. They just expect that we're going to have them, right? If they're just chock full yeah. of kids that are just excelling, it's amazing. Yeah. But you the know. thing is, uh, uh, maybe you could take us through what, I mean, they have to travel a lot. Oh, yeah. And there's a lot of related expenses. Yep. They've been to Austria this year training, Calgary. They just went to South Korea. Then they're doing a lot of domestic stuff like um, Sunday River and Sugarloaf. Mm. And um, they're going to Junior Worlds in Sweden in April. Nice. And then we're going to um, uh, Colorado this fall. Uh, the spring too yeah. so there's a lot and you know their coach just keeps coming up with more and more races because the more they do they both been on the podium it's usually morgan and maggie are like at least 
silver and bronze at the least. So if they get out there, they get attention. Yeah. And there's a better chance that they're going to get a Team USA for women in the Olympics. So. They get some good coaching. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Phelan. Mike Phelan. He's amazing. He's mm. brought those girls up. I mean, Maggie's been doing it. Gosh, I think since seventh grade. Mm -hmm. So, and she before that, she's gone through the whole sugar loaf program. Mama Jean, who yeah. I told you about, you know, she used to have her little bear and take them through Moose Alley and stuff. Yeah. So, I, and uh, Maggie used to do daycare, which was daycare slash skiing. Yeah. So, it was pretty cool. Started it's, right here. We have a lot yeah. of talent here, but they need support in order to to continue. We love to see them, uh, you know, in the Olympics too, and it's. Yeah. You started your store in Kingfield pretty much. I just, know. Uh, I you're had like a the major sponsor. Well, I started the one in Rangeley first. Yeah. And then my son also does ski cross and goes to CVA, so I started a second store. Wow. And then we're going to do a third store over in Skowhegan, our building over there. But there's only so many hours I can work, you know? <laughs> yeah, right. I need, I need some help. Yeah, yeah. Gosh. <laughs> Uh, but I know Maggie appreciates it. And, oh, uh, yeah. she's She works so hard. Yeah. I'm so proud of her. And then Will's right behind her. He wants to do the Olympics, too. So And, and, and he's always been a very good salesman for you, too. Oh, so, yeah. You know, he's he, my number he one salesman. Yeah. You lose him for that, too. <laughs> yeah, he works pretty hard, too. Tell so. us when your store is open. Uh, my store in Kingfield is open every day but Tuesday, 11 to 4. So we're right there. It's the Made in Maine shop right across from Annie's. And then our Rangeley store right now is open just Saturdays. Just on Saturdays. Yeah. 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 And we'll be open again uh, spring through fall over there. It's pretty right. busy over there. And, and of course, uh, great items there. Original uh, 1901 flag. The, oh, yeah. Uh, the yeah. real one. And yep. That 1901 flag is the Western Mountains version where we know what a tree looks like <laughs> up there. <laughs> so keep that in mind when yeah. you're voting this, uh, that's this a tree fall. Right yep. There. That's a tree. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's uh, been very well received. In fact, I guess Don Kerrigan's going to come see me next week. He's done a couple interviews, but that vote's coming up this year about um, the changeover, possible changeover. Mm -hmm. So, I'm t I take the neutral position. I kind of like the status quo. Yeah. You know, a lot of Mainers they like their flag. Yeah. And they also like the original flag. So, yeah. it's I think it's great the way it is. You yeah. know, we don't need to change things. Yeah, I mean, you, you can support both, and, and they both have yeah. a history, so. Right, exactly. Um, it, it's a cool thing. Celebrate the history. But it makes people feel like a real man. <laughs> That's right. Do you know that made the uh, flag song? that they every, I don't know if you grew up in Maine. I did. Well, that song you learned in, like, third or fourth grade about the Dirigo flag. I did not grow up in Maine, so I, didn't, I don't know it. Well, I don't, don't recall that. Yeah, <laughs> really? Yeah. Because I've had a number of But that of doesn't mean say, that they didn't do it. <laughs> I can imagine you might not pay attention in class I, when you were young. I might have been busy um, <laughs> doing something else. <laughs> Disrupting the... Just keep him quiet like that. Well, Julie, we appreciate it. Well, hopefully you'll have some people. How, if they want to help sponsor, how do they get to the, that program? They contact call CVA? CVA. Kim Karn is in charge of all the communications down there, and she can direct you all. Yeah. So it would be great. You can have, if anyone has a really well-known company or even not so well-known company, you can sponsor them and get it out there. Or you want to be a well-known company. That's right. And these <laughs> girls are like, you know, all over Maine and all over the U.S. and all over the world. Yeah. So it's pretty cool. And to be representing, t you know, the United States at these places is... Right is awesome and these girls and they're cute too so yeah. that's another good thing you know <laughs> get in at the ground floor get right? in on the ground floor cheer them on be a part of it we all love a good winning team thank you julie we all appreciate right. it. always a pleasure to see you yeah i love and, being uh, here remember 30 percent off yep all of our sugar loaf stuff yep. while they last and all your purchases do end up sponsoring the girls so. <laughs> so. I, I i truly believe that too they, oh yeah <laughs> for sure for sure that's what i work for you yeah. Yeah. You, you, you I have holes in my clothes. You, I don't have new stuff. You, you know? train every day. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. That's awesome. Thank you, Julie. And yeah. stop on by the Kingfield store and uh, say hello to Julie. She can give you more information and uh, about the artists and artisans that are in the store. They and sponsorships. Out. You can and come see me. And sponsorships. She can help you out with that, too. <laughs> That's right. She'll lead you in the right direction. That's right. We'll take a break.